Então, após minha high school, eu já apresento o bebê. when um, the, the nation and then the, the schools across Ghana uh, put more, much more emphasis on study of science and mathematics. Um, GES, in collaboration with Primetime um, Limited, have uh, planned to actually uh, make the study of science and the math more attractive to the students so that they can do better in their exams and also see how practical they can put the use of mathematics and science into uh, everyday life for national development. It is, it is in this light that uh, the Charles of uh, Ghana and then uh, Prime Time have come together and then uh, organized this science and math competition um, at the regional levels and ultimately at the uh, national levels uh, so that uh, we can actually uh, push the study of science and mathematics for our national uh, development. In, uh, as we said, uh, the study of science and mathematics is very necessary for our national development. Uh, countries which are making um, uh, great in the, in, in the world actually put a lot of emphasis on science and mathematics. So as a teacher, and uh, particularly the uh, teacher of physics, I see that it's very important to group students uh, to understand the, the basis of science, uh, which is about things around them, things about nature, and also to prepare them for uh, national development. Uh, for example, in, in terms of uh, looking at our energy problems, uh, in terms of uh, looking at drugs to cure a lot of diseases around us, and then uh, also to uh, make our nation uh, progress in science and be among the uh, developed world nations in the world. Actually, the program as we have it now is uh, an annual affair. Uh, what we are doing now is actually a regional contest to qualify uh, schools across the region to converge in Accra in June for the national contest. Uh, so since it's an annual affair and then uh, it starts around January to prepare the schools, I think it should be kept as such, an annual affair. And then uh, uh, maybe in the future if they see that it could increase the number of um, uh, or the, the competitions in the year or the number of schools that to participate, then that would be a plus for us. Mm. My name is Amo Amensa Rafael, and I'm from Maoli School, uh, 3 Science 2. And uh, Science and Maths is something we've all been looking forward to. Uh, since DHS, I've always dreamt of being part of the Science and Maths because it's um, a venture where you display your academic intellect. So when I got into HHS, I made everything possible to be become part of the Science and Maths Quiz. And I was not disappointed. I became part of the Science and Maths Quiz, and today, I was selected to um, contest for my school yeah, in the originals. Yeah. We were told that the highest score was 49, and we were looking forward to beating that point. But it was just unfortunate uh, we couldn't do that. We had 48, and we were really disappointed. We knew we would win, but we were just looking forward to beating the record. So we were a bit disappointed, although excited we are going to Accra. It's a very, very good program, and I look forward to seeing uh, bigger things than this in future, because this actually motivates us to learn very hard, go into areas we are not even supposed to go to because it goes beyond the scope of our uh, syllabus and that really opens our minds to venture into new areas and discover our talents. When I was in junior high school, I used to watch this uh, competition on the television and I had passion. I knew, I usually liked it whenever I was watching and once I told myself I need, I need to be there, I need to be there. I need to represent the school that I'll go to, the senior high school. So when I came to Maoli school, I started, I was very perseverant. I tried my best to join the team and eventually, by God's grace, I was selected. And it's just my passion. Actually, the questions were not so difficult. It's just that we made some petty mistakes. Actually, uh, from our teachers, we should have got a better mark. But because of the mistakes we made, we had that mark, even though we won. Uh, so we've ever met similar questions before. It's just that we made some little mistakes, and there was a little bit of tension in us. So, I was in high school. I am Makafu Nyamadi. 
Jikon um, University College. I am talking about the science and math quiz that was held today. Uh, I have been brought to mentor the young ones about their career choices and what the future holds for them. So today I had a 30-minute session with them. I talked to them about how I started Jikompro University College, how we started, what we are today, and what we intend to do in the next five years. Yes, we actually discussed about the things that they must do in order to first and foremost have very good careers. The first one was to discover themselves. Then after discovering, they are supposed to explore the options that are available for them. When they are able to explore the options, they take actions. Then the actions will lead them to evaluate their actions. So they have a way of assessing themselves to know whether the actions they have taken, the decisions they have taken, are worthwhile or not. Some are doing science today, but inadvertently for some few years to come, they will see that they will be very good in either art or business or all the other career options. So we are just giving them the platform to discover themselves and know what they can do for Mother Ghana in the world. We are telling them to embrace math and science. Math and science will give them the basic skills. That's the foundation upon which they can build any career. I was telling them that some of the legends who started started as math and science people. They moved to become chartered accountants. They moved to become art specialists. They moved to become IT guys and all that. So that is how it is. My name is Delight Juliana Afro, the regional coordinator for science and math in the region. Uh, the program Science and Mask we started as back as uh, 1993-94, but that one you have to apply, the schools from all the country has to apply before we will be allowed to participate in the program. But in 2014-2015, they've made it open to all the schools, second cycle and uh, schools in the region, all over the country. So here, yeah, because uh, uh, Charles, that's a head of assisted uh, secondary schools, came into partnership with the prime time. So they've allowed all the schools to participate. The main aim for this is to demystify um, learning or studying of science and math among the students. We feel, especially we the ladies, feel science and math is too difficult for us. So always we are running away from it. And more so, these are the core subjects that you qualify before going to tertiary institutions. Again, they have to, it is a competition, a rivalry competition among the second cycles, so that it will determine the champions in the science and the masses. Then again, it helps uh, the students to come together and interact and socially, uh, socialize among themselves. Yes, that is why today you see that uh, Maoli has won the contest while the others are trailing. But it will come to a time whereby the others who are trailing today will come up again. They are all interested, especially those who are offering the science as an elective science, and they have the labs, the science labs, in the various schools. Yes. But those who are not offering science, some of them are also interested in the program. Yesterday, like this, Keta Business College was here. They are into business subjects. Yet they are doing only integrated science, but they were here yesterday. Jim Bolton is an agri school. They were here Tuesday. Because they are all going to write the sciences. So they are interested. And here they will get a lot of questions to answer. And some of them, when you see them, they are holding their notepads. They are writing the questions and the answers that should be given, the correct answers. So that when they get back, they study it. And when it comes in the exams, the WASI exams, they are able to answer it. Yes. So it makes the teachers to very smart. And the contestants on the uh, days there, they are also smart because it is time bound. 30 minutes, 30 seconds, uh, 5 seconds, 10 seconds. You have to give your answer before that time. So it makes them very smart.
Yes. Before I touch on that, uh, we are facing problem with uh, some of the science teachers. You know, science is made up of physics, chemistry, biology, and IT. Just as we saw uh, Mr. Nyamadi talking to us this morning. So now we don't have such teachers here. There are not many, except for the bigger schools. We don't. We are short of chemistry masters and physics masters. As for biology teachers, they are there. But even that, some of the schools don't have the biology masters. Yes. Uh, my advice to my students, my children today, is to take the math and sciences very serious. Because if you don't have these things, you don't qualify, you don't have pass or average in it, you will not proceed to any uh, level at all in this country when you want to climb the academic ladder. Yes. So they have to take it very seriously. It has come to stay. So they should learn very hard so that we will achieve it. And to my girls, science is not all that uh, difficult. I'm the science coordinator. I'm a woman. I also studied it. So they should also embrace it. It has come to stay. So they should learn very hard so that we will get some point. Thank you very much. Your name again? My name is Delight Juliana Afu. My name is Jang Maroos, a student of Maoli, one science two. I came to support my school. Yeah, I'm very happy. <laughs> What's really? The scores they were getting, yeah, it was very high. And I'm very happy. My name is Franco Francisca. I'm in one science three. Yeah, I came to support. Why did you come out to support instead of being? I came to support and I came to also learn something from the seniors. So if I tell you to advise the other day, you are not taking advances and you see what's going to tell you. Well, I'll just I would only say to all all of us that we should try to come up and study harder so we can also take part. My name is Efriye Rachel, and I'm from Maoli School, one size one. Yes, I can support you. Because it's, it's very great when you're going in for a competition, and you're very sure of the people you're donating for the competition, you know that you win. So I was sure we win before we came. That's why, yes. My name is Jacob Florence. Why did you come out to support? Okay, because I believe that our seniors have gone into hard training by the teachers and we know that we will come out with a great victory. That's why we came to support boys. I'm very happy. I'm Agavanu Selma Nunana. Yeah. Yeah. I just know that they have been training a lot and they learn a lot and I believe that as my seniors, they have some impact on each and every one of us. As they learn a lot, like they, I don't know, influence us. So we also get to follow in their footsteps. Hopefully, next time you see a girl upstage.